Robin Dunbar is the CEO of Grid Metals and Grizzle is super excited to be interviewing him. Robin, thank you for being with us. My pleasure, Margot. It's nice to be here. Now, mining is hard, complicated, and expensive. Why are the opportunities in lithium so exciting that it's worth overcoming these obstacles? Well, you know, lithium's really the, the metal of the future. Uh, fantastic uh, uses in the EV and energy transition uh, sectors, and uh, there's uh, a tremendous opportunity in the uh, development of lithium deposits in, in Canada right now. Interesting. And do you think lithium buyers are finally starting to value sources of supply that have lower emissions and are in more stable jurisdictions? I don't know about that. I would say that uh, they're they're valuing uh, sources of lithium that they can get their hands on that are uh, you know reasonably priced that are in North America. I think the ESG considerations are there, but you know that'll maybe factor in over the longer term. But uh, if you're if you're producing uh, lithium that's uh, um, you know low carbon, that's better than high carbon for sure. And what do you think the opportunities or value is in operating and, and, and fundraising in Canada versus the U.S. or other jurisdictions? Well, Canada has traditionally been a market that, you know, allows junior companies to raise money and develop projects. And uh, the uh, regulatory environment in Canada is pretty pro-mining. So those factors, um, together with the geological prospectivity, there's, you know, there are lithium deposits in Canada. Um, you put those three factors together and, and you've got a, a good uh, recipe for, you know, developing uh, lithium deposits and getting the money and the, the regulatory and, and all the things you need to, to bring a, a mine into production. You guys are going through a very unique agreement with Tanko Mines where you guys are um, giving them your spodumene concentrate before you guys build your processing facility. If this deal is successful, do you think it will create a new standard in the industry to accelerate revenue? Well, it's a, it's a model that the Australians have used extremely successfully. And the market really seems to value projects that can come into uh, production quickly. So when you're not building a concentrator plant, which can be a $150 million cap, uh, capital expenditure, um, and that gives you kind of a much shorter timeline to production. So there's really only one producing uh, lithium mine in Canada right now. So it's not like there's a, a lot of you know, opportunities to, to do what we're trying to do. But, you know, it is a, uh, an established uh, route um, to develop a, you know, a mining operation that they've used in Australia very successfully. Lastly here, I just want to ask you, what are the opportunity for, for nickel versus lithium assets? And are there ways of leveraging the infrastructure to mine them in similar ways? Yeah, we think so. Um, you know, the base metals is a little bit different. Um, we hope to grow our nickel deposit uh, you know, much larger than it is now. So that's going to be a project with some scale. We're going to have to put in a concentrator for that. That's going to be you know, a longer timeline to production. Um, but the lithium and nickel projects are really on the same footprint. And so a lot of the infrastructure, roads and power and you know, your workforce, a, a lot of things, th there should be real economies of scale. So. You know, that's something that we're looking at and we're even seeing that in our exploration we have the same exploration team and we go to the same sites and you know split the core at the same location so yeah we think over over time um you know we'll show people we're in a really good you know mining area and uh you know we we uh, got a lot to do there and, and and we're well set up to do it well, that's very interesting. And thank you so much for taking the time to speak with Grizzle today. Definitely a lot to think about. That was Robin Dunbar, the CEO of Grid Metals.